In this video, we will talk you through the pairing process for the halo light. We have made this a simple and straightforward process to help speed up your installations. Begin by inserting the batteries into the halo light PRT, then establish power to both the heat pump control box and the receiver. Once the receiver is powered, the power LED will stay solid green, while the RF LED will flash green. The receiver and PRT will now automatically pair, and once pairing is complete, the RF light will stop flashing and turn to a solid green. Finally, check that the side switch is in the auto position. The PRT will now display simple step-by-step on-screen instructions. The device will automatically prompt you to set the time and date. It will also give you the opportunity to add a contact phone number into the device. Please note, if not entered, it will default to the Ideal Heating customer service number. At this stage, it's good to check the display on the home screen, making sure it is showing the connection icon. If you have a second heating zone, it's at this point you would add the batteries into the second PRT. And again, it will automatically pair with the second receiver, turning the RF light to solid green. Remember to check that the side switch is in the auto position. You have now fully paired the halo light. To check the halo light PRT signal strength before wall mounting, press the bottom left button once to wake the device. Press it again when menu appears on the display. Use the rotary dial to scroll to support and press to select. The signal strength will display as colour coded. Green for good, amber for poor and red for no signal.